Hi, this is Galit Gofarb and welcome to my Gorilla Life Coaching videos. Five times a week, I talk about a quote that can help you move your life to a better, healthier and happier place for you and I hope you gain a lot of value from these videos. How are you doing today? I hope you're feeling good because today our quote of the day is, at some point you will hit a plateau. If you keep doing the same things you did to get to that point, make a change by J.R. Wynn. When you are going uh, after long-term goals, there will be many plateau periods on the way to the top when it seems as if nothing is moving. And this is true. Nothing is happening during these plateau moments. But still, these are special periods, these plateau moments, because when you look back, you actually see that you have achieved something. This is the time when you can look back at your success as a stepping stone on your way to your dreams. But you can also look at what can be changed to move yourself forward. For many people, they choose to stay in their plateau where they are now more comfortable than they were when they started off, but have still not reached their end goals, their real ideal goals. They get too comfortable on the way to move themselves forward. I reached such a plateau myself a few years ago. I had made enough money for my entrepreneurial adventures to be comfortable for the rest of my life. I did keep working for the fun of it, but I lost most of my motivation to make more money. I was really too comfortable. I did not reach the goals I dreamed of reaching at that moment, but I was still happy enough. So I can totally relate to someone who is stuck in a comfortable plateau that may be far from their real dreams, but comfortable enough to stay there. But this is the time to walk the boat if you really want to reach the life of your dreams with the achievements of your dreams. When you do reach a plateau on any on your way to any one of your goals, then firstly, celebrate what you have achieved until this point. Look at your achievements. What have you learned? What have you changed to get to where you are now? What habits did you form and adopt to get you to where you are today? It is very important to acknowledge your forward movement. I would even recommend preparing a timeline of where you were in the beginning. You, you like draw a straight line and then you write down where you were in the beginning. What, what skills did you have in the beginning? And, and all else that you had uh, um, in that area of your life at the beginning. And at the end of the timeline, write down uh, how you see this area of your life when it is completely perfected in its ideal form. Also make a note of where you currently are on this timeline. Where exactly do you stand today on your path to your dreams? Write down your current situation in that area of life. Now do this for all areas of your life, your relationships, your career, your financial situation, your home, your emotional state, peace of mind, your social life, your health and fitness levels, and your life vision. Now, you can celebrate your success in each area and enjoy your plateau period for a while. I recommend stating exactly how long you plan to enjoy your new plateau, where you are maintaining your new skills and habits, but just not making any new progress forward. I recommend two weeks up to three months is great for a plateau period, but no more. If you really want to live the life that you will be proud of, a life that will make you happy, uh, do not stop for long progressing towards your dreams. Don't stop getting better at what you really want to get better at. There may be people in your life saying that, that you, what you've reached is good enough for them. It may be good enough for them, but is it really good enough for you? Many people uh, may not be happy with your growth. They may see it as a threat to themselves. Many, many people do not like to see their friends or spouses grow beyond what they can handle because they may feel insecure because of this growth. They may feel that their own life needs to be improved as well, and they just don't like that feeling. And they may not be willing to do the work and prefer to stay small. And if you listen to them, you will fall into their plan of life for you, not exactly the life that you have planned for yourself. Whenever you reach a plateau in any area of your life, you basically have two choices, to fall back or to rise up. And this is when you can really see your commitment to your life goals and to the life of your dreams. Will you quit 
or will you continue until you reach the finish line? This is all up to you. I know that it's very difficult to keep working at something when you must renew yourself every time in order to progress. But as I said in the past videos, you cannot be the same person who you were when you set your goals and dreams. You need to be a different person. You need to have different skills and different habits and a different mindset than the ones you started off with in order to reach your goals. If these skills and habits and mindset were part of your life beforehand, then you would have already had the things that you want to have in your life. When you reach a plateau, you stop making progress towards your goals. And when you stop making progress, you will not be as happy because progress equates happiness for most people. But progress cannot continue linearly. linearly. It's not a straight line. There must be spikes of change on the way. And this is also normal with any weight loss or fitness plateau. You will need to adjust your diet to your new weight. And for fitness, you will need to change the workout routine to continue to grow muscle, muscle mass. There are, these are small examples that really explain what needs to be done to overcome a plateau. To overcome a plateau, you will need to put in different or more dedicated efforts. And dedicated effort is learning new skills, changing something about yourself, trying new ideas, or even just putting in more effort than you previously uh, did or previously needed to do. When you reach a plateau, you have to decide whether you are going to stay committed to your goals and to your ideal life vision, or are you going to stay in your newfound comfort zone and say that you have enough for yourself? It is your choice. Put everything on a scale and decide. Can you live with this level of satisfaction? It is yours to decide because it is your life. You are the one making the decisions and you are the one who will need to live with the consequences of your choices. So as I always do with these videos, I will provide you with a question that you want to ask yourself so that you, your answer will help move your life to a better place for you. And the question of the day is, where in my life am I currently at a plateau of progress? And what are the next steps that I need to make to progress uh, in the way I want to? And am I committed to reach the next level? As Beyonce says in her song, Level Up, she says, thank God I never settled. The view is so much better. And this is so true. As I recommend, as I usually recommend, write down this question in a notebook that you have especially prepared for these coaching sessions so that you can look over your answers and make sure that you are always progressing towards your goals. Now, to finish off, the affirmation of the day is, I choose to be the rare one who goes beyond the plateau and continues on the path to my dreams no matter what. I choose to be the rare one who goes beyond the plateau and continues on my path to my dreams no matter what. Now tell this affirmation to yourself as many times as you remember to do so today because with repetition, an affirmation has the power to completely transform your life so that you think differently, behave differently, and achieve your dreams. So thank you very much for joining me here today. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Please also subscribe to my channel and ring the notifications button so you get notified every time I upload a new video. And also please visit my website, thegorillediet.com, for anything to help you progress in the weight, health, and wellness uh, areas of your life. Thank you very much for joining me.